you know, well, when men use humor, it's sexy. <laughs> Humorous women are scary. <laughs> yeah. Believe me, I know I'm a comedian and my love life is so <laughs> zero. <laughs> Through training a lot of people in society, uh, I was so surprised really how many people think that the uh, more authority you have or the higher education, the less humor you are allowed to use because it makes you less respectable. Like this. People come to me and they bring something they are going to talk about. They say, and I was wondering, I should maybe talk about, you know, when we opened this uh, uh, new store and, and, and everybody was very happy and it was going well. And uh, is that okay? Uh, yeah, sure, use anything you have. And then they start the presentation. Good evening. It's nice to have you here all. And we are all thoroughly happy <laughs> being able to open the store. <laughs> Monotone ventriloquist, you know. Um, or just what we do usually, spit in his coffee. <laughs> so use the, the stand-up technique, which is the best technique. That is, make fun of yourself. Tell stories about yourself. And so and he took up the microphone and was going to say something to save the situation. And then there was this screeching and the microphone. And, and then he uh, did this brilliant thing. He just took it away and said, OK, how do you like it so far? <laughs> this motivational speaker in one of the many seminars I go to to become a better person or a healthier person or something. And she had broken her arms or she had a plaster, a cast. And, and said, oh, I want to start by explaining this cast on my hand. Uh, those of you who have just bought the book Sex for Middle-Aged Women, <laughs> there is a misprint on page 205. <laughs> There is time to laugh, and there is time not to laugh. And this is not one of them. <laughs> Thank you very much. my environment in every room, you know, <laughs> fall or uh, unless I, I really focus on my movements. <laughs> to imagine one piece of rice between the cheeks. <laughs> <laughs> And I went to the bathroom, and my, of course, my dad took the tablecloth. <laughs> Twelve people trying to drop Wait a minute. And I, I really, I, at that moment, I have no humor at all. No, I just want to cry. <laughs> and then my ex-husband, who was sitting on the next table, just yep, up to help me and said, yeah, you're just with her tonight. I lived with her for 30 years. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He never found it funny. He 